Welcome to this ELC self-learning video. Today we'll be looking at how to avoid common errors when using adjectives in interviews. Good morning, Mr. Tay. Thank you for coming. Good morning, and I appreciate this opportunity very much. Okay, so shall we get started? Sure. So I understand from your CV that you have been an assistant financial advisor for the past year. So why are you suddenly interested in changing fields and becoming a teaching assistant? Mm. Yes, I realize that this may seem to be an awkward career move, but I've always been interested in working closely with people. I've always been interesting? Don't you mean I have always been interested? Interesting is an adjective that describes the subject of the sentence as intriguing. So the phrase, I have always been interesting, implies that what the interviewee believes to be interesting is the subject I, which is himself. Clearly, this interviewee is not trying to sell how much he believes himself to be interesting or worth the attention of other people. Interested is an adjective that describes what the speaker wants to know more about. Usually, interested is followed by the preposition in, and then what the speaker is interested in. So by saying, I have always been interested in, the interviewer would be looking forward to what comes next. Let's look at these two sentences side by side. You'll see how easy it is to tell the difference. If we begin the sentence with I am, and then complete the sentence with the adjective interesting, this sentence is already a complete sentence that has a complete meaning. Because I is what the speaker believes to be fascinating. However, if we finish the sentence with interested, the sentence is not complete. Because we still do not know what the speaker wants to know more about. So in order to complete the sentence, the speaker will have to add the preposition in and then state what he is interested in. One more thing, remember the pronunciation of interested. The ED has the it sound, interested. Yes, I realize that this may seem to be an awkward career move, but I've always been interested in working closely with people to develop better interpersonal and communication skills. As an assistant financial advisor, I've learned to be presentable with confidence. Do you mean presentable and confident? Or presentable with confidence? In this sentence, the interviewee said, I have learned to be presentable with confident. Now, we should all know that prepositions should be followed by nouns. Confident, however, is an adjective. And so in this case, we should change the with into and. By doing so, the sentence is now in parallel structure with two adjectives. Another way to correct the sentence would be to change confident into confidence. As confidence is a noun, we can place it after the preposition with. As an assistant financial advisor, I've learned to be presentable and confident. After working in this position for a year, I believe it is the right time for me to step into another field so I can develop different aspects of interpersonal and communication skills. And I know it is important. Another error? Why don't you help him correct it this time? Okay, for more help with your adjectives, remember to visit SIL in A305 or Z213. And visit the SIL Facebook page by scanning the QR code or clicking the link below this video.